not random. When you're planning your fartlek programs as part of your level 3 PT, just know that fartlek, although it stands for speed play and random play, it actually is not random. Your client might look at it and say, well, that's a random program, but you've put every single adjustment in speed, every adjustment in incline or level is there for a reason. And that reason is gonna create a specific physiological adaptation, which will allow your client to get closer to their goal. So let's say, for example, your client is preparing for an obstacle course race. They know they've got a certain amount of where they're level and they're aerobic, and then they go anaerobic for a little bit, and then they go aerobic for a bit, and you can kind of predict what that would look like. You could create your fartlek plan to mimic that exact changing in heart rates and energy zones. So as you go through, and you actually now need to do your homework, to find out what your client's real end goal is and where they're at in their current training and then create your fartlek to mimic that end outcome. And this will give you a really good fartlek that is appropriate and help them actually prepare so that they have an efficient and specific fartlek CV program. If you have any questions about fartlek or CV programming, then drop them in the comments box below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next video.